Okay, Sam, so here's a really easy question for you. What is track and field? Track and field. I always say track and field is probably the greatest sport ever. <laughs> um, but basically for track and field, we have events on the track that the kids can do. There's the sprints, so the 100, the 200, 300, up to 400. There's 80 meter hurdles for the midget girls, which are new 16s. Um, 100 meter hurdles, 110 meter hurdles. There's 400 meter hurdles. Then we have the middle distances where it's 800 up to the 1500 meters. And then the longer distances with the 5K and 10K plus all the field events. So there's long jump high jump, triple jump, shot put, discus, so there's tons of events. <laughs> Track and field is also a terrific opportunity for athletes from other sports to cross train, isn't it? Yes, uh, we have quite a few multi-sport athletes in our program actually, uh, from football, hockey, speed skating, gymnastics, soccer, lacrosse, rugby. <laughs> so it's great training for your other sports because you're getting the aspects of the speed, the explosiveness and the power. So it's great training for other sports as well in their off season to come and join and then a lot of them end up staying and are able to balance doing both sports at the same time but we really encourage the kids to uh, be multi-sport athletes just to be well-rounded. It is really a community a sport where there's something for everybody isn't there? Yes definitely I always say when the kids come out like we like to have them try everything but there's a spot for everyone so whether you're more inclined to the sprints or the jumps or the throws everybody can find a home in track. With Paralympian Jen Brown now, and that's a wonderful thing about track and field as well as the accessibility. Can you just speak to that, you know, as an MS survivor? Yeah, well that's the excellent thing about track and field in Kowtow specifically, is that there is literally a place for everyone. You know, if you're speedy, if you're strong, if you're fast, if you have, you know, limited mobility or if you have full mobility, there's a place for everyone within this club. It's really fantastic that we have people from, you know, age 8 to the Paralympic Olympic level and everyone in between at every level of ability. Who can participate, would you say, in track and field? Everyone. <laughs> so uh, we have a meet here and we've had uh, three-year-olds that are doing like the 50 meters and that, all the way up to, I believe, the oldest athlete in Caltech right now is like mid-40s, but um, you've got master's athletes even up to like 90 years old, so everybody can do track. Physical benefits, Sam? It's lifelong. Everybody's always concerned about like young girls stopping sport but if you can get them in sports you know like at a young age around 10 or so and continue through to their teen years then there's a greater chance that they're going to be active for the rest of their life. I always like to mention to parents about your wonderful cheetahs program. Can you tell us a little bit more about Cheetahs, what it is? So the Cheetahs program, it's designed for athletes that are 8 to 11 years old. We have three sessions. So we have our fall session, which is cross country, and that's about 8 to 10 weeks. Then we have our indoor session, which is January to March. And so we're training on the indoor tracks. For our competitions, we get to go up to Edmonton to the Butter Dome for indoors. And then our outdoor session starts in April and ends in June. In our JD program, we have athletes that uh, started when they were seven or eight and they're still competing now, so six years. And so they've met kids from when they were seven that are still their friends now. And then they continue on in the sport once they get to the midget age. Those are the same people that they're gonna compete against and travel with. And once they get older as a senior athlete, those same people. Now, how about for adults? How can they get involved in track and field with Caltaf? Uh, the same sort of thing. We, in our senior groups and that, we have um, with our sprints and then uh, some in the middle distance as well. It's just like with the younger guys, they come out and training the same time and competitions as well for them if they're interested in competing or just being active themselves. I know a lot of parents, while their kids are out on the track, they go out running too. And is it two or three times a week for adults? Uh, you know, I'm thinking of the working professionals here in Calgary. You know, that would be something that they would work out with the coach, but generally three days a week would be good. How do I know if I'm in the right discipline? Uh, well, a lot of it is just trying it out and just seeing if it's a good fit. Because there's so many events to try, you just sort of try it and sort of see what feels like a good fit, and then you sort of proceed from there. Where do we train? So in the fall, which is sort of our base season in cross country, that we would train at Confederation Park, Canmore Park, uh, Edworthy Park as well. And then when we transition to the indoor season, so we're inside in the indoor tracks, we're at the Repsol Center and up at UFC at Jack Simpson. And then when we transition back to the outdoor season for the outdoor track, we would be at Glenmore Track and Foothills Track. And can I try out for a practice? Oh yes, definitely. So we have a two week trial period so that you come to the practices and try it out for two weeks and see that it's a good fit. Usually people really like it. And so then they join officially at that point. What would you say that track and field, the sport, what do you think it gives these kids, the adults that are in the program, you as a coach, what does it give all of you? Oh, so <laughs> much. Uh, I, I think 
for a lot of the kids, it's uh, the discipline, goal setting, time management, and then you get to the physical benefits, just feeling strong and feeling good about yourself and uh, the improvements that, every day it's like daily improvements that you make and just sort of feeling good about yourself, that confidence that you get from it. Calgary's watching. What do you say to that 40 year old plus or the parent of a young child about why they should pick up track and field? I say definitely you should come on out and uh, give it a try. Our website is www.caltap.com and our phone number is 403-686-6011 and come for a two week tryout period just to see if that's a good fit but I think you'll find that you'll love it and want to join with us. Thanks. And if you would like to learn more about this sport or any other activity, just check out Sport Calgary's website at sportcalgary.ca.